Okay, where do you want me to stand? Right in front of the mic is good. And you guys just want me to read some hymns? Oh, these are better than hymns. Way more inspiring and relevant. Oh, I feel like dancing. It's foolishness, I know. But when the world has seen the light, they will dance with joy like we're dancing now. Yeah. This is a religious song? Yeah. About God. Yes. The Bible God. That's the one. Ugh. In the secret, in the quiet hour, I wait only for you, because I want to know you more. I want to touch you. I want to see your face. So you're telling me that people sing this stuff in church? Yeah. Men sing this in church. Well, usually just the guy in the praise band sings it. Everyone else just puts their hands up in the air and sways to the soothing soft rock rhythm like they're at a Phil Collins show in 1986. Well, that sounds about right. Freedom, 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 freedom. When oceans rise, my soul will rest in your embrace, for I am yours and you are mine. You sure I got the right words here? Because this doesn't much sound like church music to me. What does it sound like? Like what would happen if my six-year-old granddaughter married a Care Bear and they wrote their own wedding vows. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, yes. Yeah, this is worse than the script for Pink Cadillac. All right, next song. Ugh. What's the matter, Clint? Well, I guess I'm just a bit confused. This Christian music doesn't really talk about grace or forgiveness in any meaningful way. In fact, a lot of it doesn't even mention Christ by name. Right, so what's the problem? Well, since Paul says in Colossians 3.16 that the purpose of sacred music is to teach people who Jesus is and what he's done for us, you'd think that people who write sacred music today might at least want to name drop the Son of God into one of their little ditties. <laughs> yeah, you'd think that, but no. I will call upon your name. I call upon your name, I mean never actually say your name in this song When oceans rise, I'm gonna sing the theme from back to the future Because it's pretty much the same chord progression Dude, why are you making fun of all our songs? Well, maybe it's because I don't much care for it when Christians toss their greatest musical treasures in the garbage in order to sing a bunch of Josh Groban knockoff barely religious cheeseball ballads for soccer moms what, you know something better? Well, how about this? Now I will cling forever to Christ my Savior true. My Lord will leave me never, whatever he passes through. He rends death's iron chain. He breaks through sin and pain. He shatters hell's dark thrall. I follow him through all. Dude, that was awesome. Can we record that with the band? Are they any good? Oh, we've got the best praise band in the state. These guys can play anything. All right, let them know the song has three sharps and seven chords. Yeah, okay, well, never mind then, Mozart. Everybody blames the Lutherans. 